your nail live. I'm going to pop in a eight minute risotto post. Excellent. Oh, hello, Bella Bolo. How are you? And I'm going to pin that. Pin comment done. And we're going to go live on Facebook as well, guys. Smiley, how you going? Excellent. All right, well. And Sophia the Sausage. That's a really great one. I'll, I absolutely love that. So, guys, you may notice that um, I'm on my own because Mick's working. He's away. Um, and he's plowing paddocks and he's doing all sorts of amazing things for Australia farming um, but I have a stand-in so enter in your car no. this is me here he is anyway bigger fatter brighter better looking <laughs> way taller Mick anyway <laughs> So guys, this is my, I'm going to give you a glass for that, Daggy, so, so that we've got Mick in front and centre with Could us. Could you fill it with something? Well, no, because we're going to, yeah, you're going to fill it with Mick. Oh, right. Go. Not what I had in mind, but we're going to go, yeah, grab your drink, though, because we're all oh, about right. having a drink here. Where is your drink? Here. Yeah. Yeah. Champagne Always. food on bed. You haven't got the right, um, you haven't well, got it's the right. budget. So you I'll haven't got the right. Stubby holder, love. But anyway, right. doesn't mind. Right. Doesn't matter. Right. 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 I can get you the right one. Have a horse on one something? No, it's a champagne food on a beer budget. Oh, one. sorry, my mistake. So, to introduce you guys to this is my daggy. Uh, well, Daryl is his name, but I call him my daggy. This is who I march with on um, on Anzac Day. He's a Vietnam vet, and uh, we do our thing, don't we? This is the first year where we weren't able to do our thing. Yes. And now that the restrictions have been lifted and mix away, we're able to catch up. So. Mm -hmm. My obligations do finish when I, this, yeah, yeah. <laughs> mix not it. Yeah. You, he's going to do just a fine job. So what we're going to do is we're going to do an eight minute risotto. Oh, I've got a couple of little, actually I'll do those in a minute, Rosa, I'll get to those. You're going to do some cutting up, Daggy. You're going to cut up some mushrooms. Yep. We're going to do an eight minute risotto. We spoke about it last week. We're going to do it on the stove top, which you're not going to be able to see most of the stuff, but um, it's all about the eight minute thing at the end of the day. Um, I'm going to chop some onions. You're going to do some mushrooms. Yeah, you know, the last time I chopped mushrooms, I lost two fingers, but they've grown back. So, <laughs> so is I'm that gonna... like that? What are you, you'd yeah. be good at the grandfather jokes. How do you do that? Remember that one? No. No. I'm, not, I'm, old, I'm not old, but I'm about that old. Not that old. You are old, way older than oh. me, though. All right. So swap sides, please. So if you can please cut up about half that bag of mushrooms, this will be good. And uh, so this is like start now. Yes, please. So I want you to um, slice, yeah, you just have a go, see how you go. I've been Don't doing cut this your, for years. Cut this for years. Look at you. I'm going to do an onion quickly. And then we're going to bang on the, um, we're going to bang on the pressure cooker on the right. stove. Do you need my advice for that or can you do that on your own? Well, you're the man that went to war. You probably know a shitload more about stuff than I do, I would imagine. Uh, only so. about walking, walking. and... Uh, <laughs> yeah. and wet feet and yeah, sleeping in the dark and, cooking. and all that sort of stuff. Look at this. And let's not... Look at you go. I could have been born to this, you know. Exactly right. I have some really good friends, like my little friend just there. Yeah. Oh, you're made here. Oh, yeah, they can't he see. Oh. Oh, is it? oh, no, you can on Instagram. But he taught me everything I know. Yes. We've got our little. Um, you have to take that out. Our little just touch out. Cut that off, no, yeah. you use the stem. Right. So people that wash their mushrooms, don't wash your mushies or peel the skins, I should say. Wash them off. Don't peel the skins and don't take the stems out. You're throwing away half of your bloody good stuff. Well, so not cheap. Right now. Well, exactly right. But um, let's look at the speed that I've got on this onion. I'm so not used to cutting onions. This is mixed job. Oh, normally. Oh. Keep going, love. Oh, keep going. Yeah, Lord. keep going. I need about 200 grams. So the beauty of this recipe, gang, is that it takes eight minutes from the time your um, pressure cooker starts going. Ch -ch 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 -ch. If you haven't got a stovetop pressure cooker, you might have an electric pressure cooker, which we've got. Um, but 
if you haven't got a pressure cooker, then you're doing it, you know, like normal, normal. It takes 25 minutes, Daddy. Can I, is this knife blunt or are these mushrooms tough or something? Or yeah, no, mushrooms are tough. Am I not doing it right? The mushrooms tough. No, well, I'll let you in on the secret. The mushrooms right. probably should have been used about three or four days ago, so they're a little bit soft. Tough, and it's the perfect time, it's the perfect time to use your mushrooms for a risotto because they're feeling a little bit sad amongst themselves. Right. Yeah. So um, I'll just quickly check a few comments, Daggy, just to see if everyone's happy with the company that I'm keeping. Would that be get that bloke off? <laughs> I hope not. Oh, so <laughs> Smiley, I've got, yes, Smiley did one of our, um, Ashley May. She'll recognise who's here. Ashley, do you realise that it's our young Daggy here with yeah, us? Yeah, I like that. Yeah, Tiana, the heaven, hello gorgeous. Um, Colette as well, the dial tone. Uh, what do we got here? Trace, finally. Oh, Sandy Davies will know who's here as well. Tracy's saying, who's the other guest? Thank you for asking. This is my mate, Daryl, that I call Daggy, that I march with on Anzac Day. Um, because drink mi with. mix away. Well, we do drink together as well. You've got to tell them, I don't always come around here with Merrily Jones. Dad, what Good. are you doing? <laughs> doing me best. <laughs> So this is where we're at. Mix away, but as we did introduce Daggy when he first got here, Mix also here as well. So we've made sure that um, he's in keeping with the company. And um, things go ahead, guys, just because your partner's missing or whatever. Um, it's nice to have some company. And, um, you know, and what also we didn't get to march on Anzac Day. So... No. Look at this olive bloom of a very accomplished chef. See that? That what? is very good, Dad. I don't reckon Mick can do it that good. Um, well, not with your hey. finesse, I've got to say. You reckon you could? <laughs> You've got finesse. Should I remind the visitors of the vote? Just remember, it's Mick. <laughs> He's doing a good job. He's doing a good job. Oh, I'm moving Mick out of the way. That was a bit rude, wasn't it? All right, so I'm going to actually put the... Um, the pressure cooker on, start getting it warmed up. Yep. And I apologise, you know, normally we'd have our stove top happening here, but because it's not, I can't do it on a, um, on the induction cooker, so I've got to do it on the stove, unfortunately. But most of this is boring, because it's going to be eight minutes of going, We've well, often done eight minutes of, <laughs> That's those, yeah, your videos. Uh, usually when we're playing pool and stuff at the shed, aren't we? Did I ever tell you that I'm a pool champion? Oh, yeah. Well, Mick says the show, same thing as well. I never... You two are so competitive on that pool. I mean, you know, I, well, I didn't want the word to get out, so... Mm -mm -mm. I just had challenges yeah. come from If Mick was here, he'd go, shut up, Daggy. He reckons that yeah. he's shit at yeah. pool. Yeah. And you, what do you say about him? He's shit at pool. Well, he needs to learn to take his blindfold off. He might even... <laughs> So we've got more to go? Just um, a half bag? Yeah, yeah, I reckon do, yeah, just that one more and you should be right. So. Are you going to remember this recipe, Daggy, and cook it at home? Am I a computer? Of course I will. <laughs> what more can I say? Peeps? He's, uh, he's amazing. He is amazing because he went to fight for Australia. He's our returned uh, serviceman. And um, I've seen all his medals. I've marched beside him, like I said, every Anzac day. I'm well, missing a VC and a few other Purple Hearts and all that sort of stuff. But other than that, they haven't had them delivered to you yet, isn't that the case? Or? I think that's right, yeah. <laughs> um, we do have an amazing day on Anzac Day. They don't really I'd like have to all the kids, all your grandkids yeah. and everything join us. And I'd you. like to be able to do that, you know. Not the mushies, though. No, I'll, mushies. I'll let you do that. I'll let you do that with some um, parsley right. later. Right. Are you happy to do that? Yeah. yeah. Excellent. Yeah. Well, that's good. I mean, what they don't know on these things is the amount of money that us as friendly chefs get. <laughs> <laughs> so oh, you're yeah. actually costing me money now. Oh. As well as the fact that I'm feeding you. Yeah. Yeah, as well as the fact that I've built a fire. We yeah. have a fire pit going. You know the fire pit guys that we did our cook around the other night? I've got the fire pit going. Out, out there for these hey, guys. So, Dad's is here with his wife, by the way, just so that you know. Yeah, I was just going to say, as I said to people, I hope they don't think I just drop in. No, no, there. no, exactly. So, Kaz uh, is here as well. And uh, she cut off. my hair. So, I, I had a haircut, guys. Fine. There she is. <laughs> She's out the side like that. She's like, no, no, no. 
Um, I cut, I had a, I gave myself a haircut today, and then Kaza finished it off for me. I would have had one had I so, known I was going to be here, but. Exactly. Well, so, you so don't we don't need a haircut. Enough. Tress, hello, Thank lovely. You. One for the road. Bella as well. Chicken meats. Kieran, Chicken how meat. are you going? Yeah, absolutely. Jess is a bit late today. DJ Bowman Racing. How's the horses going, pal? We did noticed... get some very nice crump chops off. Jake Raw is up Chicken there. Meat. Oh, here we go. Erin Langman. Pete wants to know if Mick is in the slow cooker. <laughs> Tough cut, mate. <laughs> oh, that's terrible. He's a bit too early. He's in the freezer. He's in the freezer. Um, and really? there's my mummy has just joined as well. Everyone Hello, say man. hi to mum. Hello, Hello, Marg. How you going? And Vernon's just joined. Rianda hey. as well. Where are the rollers? I took them out, love, because it's we're cooking now. So that's all good. Look at this. Check on this. Look at you go. All right, enough oh. now with the mushrooms. The mushrooms? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Back off. Back I suppose off. I'm now the, in the sink doing the dishes. No, no, keep that there because you're going right. to do some, um, you're going to do some uh, parsley shortly. I'm just practicing. Now we're going to pretty good, yeah. I've got to say. I've got to get my champagne out because I've got champagne. no white wine. Do you know, this is really funny. What? I drink champagne too. Do you? Would yeah. you like a champagne? Don't mind if I do. All right. I'm going to get you a champagne. One, two, ten. Um, How many bottles you got? <laughs> a couple. Um, no, I'm going to get you a different glass. In. I need this to actually cook with. What? Oh, coronavirus, no beer. Coronavirus says we can't share the same glass. Have that in the... Have that oh, in coronavirus the dust. Yeah. Yep. I can't believe you're drinking that. It's got four crosses on it. Got no hands. sugar. Oh, is that what it is? You're watching your uh, watching your waistline. All right. So I, and along with trouble. these onions, I'm going to throw in some garlic. I've got no fresh garlic, so I'm much to my embarrassment yeah. throwing in a clove's worth of garlic, and then. I want 300 grams of rice. So I'm going to load that up there. I'm going to get a bowl. We're going to put that there. I'm going to tear that. Right. Yep, look at that. And Arborio rice. We're going to throw that in. And we're going to get our rice. Nice and comfy with itself. How does rice get nice and comfy with itself? It's it gets, in a bag. Yeah, I know, but it's going to get nice and comfy with itself in the um, in the pressure cooker. Oh, 300 right. grams yeah. of it, and it's going to go like that with all the oil. Olive oil. This is one I prepared earlier, which I have to pass to the assistant chef. Here we go. <laughs> that was Kaz, by the way. If you, yeah, no one would have seen that. Oh, <laughs> She's like, yeah. <laughs> She's like the phantom. All right, so that's all good. I'm throwing in my rice, and we're gonna give that about two or three minutes to get all coated in that oil, Daddy, because what we wanna do is get that rice, like I said, feeling comfortable with itself. It's gonna start yeah. relaxing and, you know. Yeah, I don't know. I've never been in a pressure cooker before, but I wouldn't find it that relaxing. Well, but still, I'm not a bit of rice. Well, it's, well, the pressure's not on yet. This is I thought I'd never know. And you've never used it, I bet. Not allowed to. Kaz, please explain. Oh, it's old. It's quickly. It's old. So is this I one. I bought it at an up shop. I oh, got bought it at an up shop too. Yeah. Well, I didn't. Uh, Rob Vesti actually yeah, gave me one. Older than yours. Please explain. Well, not much older. It's got everything that works. We'll try and get her in here to explain. Yeah. You, you're one of these people like my mum, aren't you? Mm -hmm. That goes, oh, no, it's going to blow the roof off and it's going to do That's this exactly and it's going to do that. The problem, yeah. yeah. No. Depends on the um, security system, but mine has got, see this lever, and see that. Yeah, I think we've got one of those too, but I think she's a bit scared of that that will go off like a... No, see, it won't come off. And no. Bang, through the roof or something, you know? Mike, I would expect you to be more scared of that than anybody. And, and you're not. No. Yes. Feels. Exactly, yeah. So, I'm going to wait for that to sort of do its little thing. Now, the benefit here, guys, if you were doing this on the stove top, right, you've got to keep your stock hot. You've got to do it a ladle at a time. You've got to wait until it soups it all up. And um, it takes forever, 25 minutes plus, 
This will be done in eight minutes from the ch 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 and we're going to open it up. We're going to put some, yeah, yep. 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 we're going to put parmesan okay. in and it's going to be um, good to go. I'm going to deglaze, I should be deglazing with white wine and I don't have any. So I'm going to deglaze with champagne. Happy days. So now I know why we haven't got two glasses because that bottle's only out of pool. Well, that's exactly right, because that's what I've been drinking. Yeah. Uh, well, that's what I've been filling up my I glass with. I sort of. Can I you do, do it with red? Pool. Can you do it with red? You can actually do red. You can do red, you can do white, but obviously it's going to make you, um, your wine pink. You need to stand in front of your shopping cart, oh, please, Daddy. Um, because you're standing off screen. You can tell he's right, got no right. TV experience, can you? Sure. Plenty of experience star, in the know. field. Could have been a star, but... Well, yeah, that's what we're trying to make you to be didn't, now. Just didn't and go my way. Guess what? Our reminder just went off. We need to check in. I just said a reminder. Let For me see. what? And, look. Yep. Oh, I'm going to... Oh, no. Oh, hang on. Here we go. Got a special guest, hopefully. A special guest? Yeah. Oh. Come on, will ya? I'm hoping that someone's going to be able to join us. Kaz's mum's even here. Jeez. It's not that bloke that does the paleo stuff, is it? What's his name? Join us. Hello, Trace. Oh, there we go. No, still not happening. Oh, I thought I was going to be good at this. I was trying to get Mick in on this and uh, your viewers. Oh. So, Mick, if you can hear me, let's see if you can request to join us because it's not working for me to join you. So, is Mick watching? Mick, he is. He's with you. <laughs> so, we're hoping Mick's actually in a tractor, guys, driving up near a place called Tel Cook, which is near Warcool. Uh, he's been going since 7 a.m. this morning. So. Does he need any advice on how to drive a tractor? Because I'm good at that too. <laughs> You're good at that too. There is just nothing you can't do. Is uh, there? A few things but at this age, but the uh, rest pretty good. No, not happening. Mum, uh, you can use stock too. Exactly. Well, I'm going to use stock, Mama. Um, Mum's saying that you can use stock after you've deglazed with your um, champagne, which I'm going to do now. Um. Alright, so I'm going to go with about 100 mils of, listen to that, hear that? Mm. That, oh, good. that's the good bit that gets all your brown stuff off the bottom of your pan with your champagne, oh, yeah. well, or your white wine, or your red wine, but like I said, your, um, it's just going to make your rice go pink if, um, if you use red wine, and then you're going to throw your stock in. And I only made 500 mil of stock and I need 600. So, so what's the stock? What? Chicken. What as in? Chicken stock. Oh, right. Yeah. So if you make your own, fantastic. If you use cubes, it's not going to matter. Uh, we're going to let that come up to a bit of a boil. And the only reason I'm going to let that come up to a bit of a boil is it's going to reduce my um, time to get the pressure happening. So I'll let that go for a little bit. So I've and, got... Uh, you're, I'm sure I'm here for me good looks, but I got to do something else. Have I? Got to yeah. chop. I'm just practicing. See if we've got me happening yet. Still in tractor replying to John. Yeah, I don't know. Sorry, guys. We're not so obviously used to this. You chop all of this, like no, the stems and everything. Or? Um, see if you can request to be in somehow, Mick. I'm not sure how that works, but. Um, Mum, you don't need wine. Best to drink it. Very true. Absolutely. <laughs> what are you doing? This stuff, if you hit it, probably takes off like a little bullet. <laughs> oh, all over the floor. We don't want the stems. You so, don't use the stems? No, we don't want the stems. Oh, so right. what you want to do is you want to strip out the... This is parsley out of the garden. So you just want to take the heads off. You didn't teach me enough. I did leave you to your own devices yeah. too, which isn't nice. Well, he didn't, he's my mentor. He didn't tell me. Yeah. So you want to take all your little stems uh, off. You want to leave good. the nice flowery bits in there. Right, eh? I'm close to a bit of a boil going on here. So I'm going to literally, I'm going to throw my mushrooms in. Daggy's mushrooms in. Cut precision. And I'm going to close the lid. 
and it's going to turn out at the other end a risotto and you're going to be amazed guys but we still do have to wait for the ch 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 but I'm going to turn I like the ch 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 I know it's heaps of fun hey you know I'm a really good ch 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 when I've got a bottle of sour red in me <laughs> which <laughs> you know but you know you did bring one, I noticed that. I did, I did, I did. We will do that around the fire. Over the years, I've never really travelled too far from... Now, I just... Okay. Like, put this in, get rid of that stuff. All that. that so I'm going to turn the heat up temporarily yeah. on my uh, pressure cooker. And once it starts doing it, I'm going to turn it back down. So I've now got about 10 minutes spare where we can try and... So, but I hit just the white ne circle next to the up, comment right? box. Thank you box white circle comment box exactly. oh up here maybe oh. no I'm still not getting a comment box thanks Trace for trying to help though um, Mick Barlow no. Uh, no I did have a white comment though happening earlier I'm sure I'm doing this right I'd say that you are Come off it. Sorry guys, it's very boring for you, but we are literally trying to get, um, oh, the racing game's a bit slow. Kind of insane. Oh, there goes another knuckle. Can you bits, <laughs> you gotta do it in like that, love. Hey. Oh, hang on, I'll move this so that people can see what you're up to. Right. So that if there is an accident, it's, we've, we've caught it live for- um, Insurance. Insurance, yeah. Everyone's trying to get Mick on, which is awesome. So, thank you. I see him doing that he's sometimes. He's What's he's 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 yeah. Mm. You better do just a quick hello so that people actually do know that, that your wife is here. Oh, yeah. Kaz is quickly, she's going to do a quick zip through. Like to introduce. <laughs> or you could do a do do do. Oh, here do, do, she do. is. Here she is. Oh. <laughs> Yes, so he didn't come on his own. <laughs> Turn up. <laughs> yeah, our Kaz are I sort of really rather that we left him in um, thinking, you know, no, the wife's not there, mixed up. Yeah, <laughs> no, well, yeah. Yeah. Should have left it just his, well, yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Just so that everybody knows. I'm not up to fun and games when Mick's not here. Well, I am up to fun and games when Mick's not here. I'm on my side, but. Look, I, reckon, I reckon I've got this down pat. Well, you're getting there, Rish. Can I show you something? Yes. Yeah. Yep. Okay. Get it all riddled together. Knife skills are killing Abby. Abby said your knife skills are killing Abby. See that? Wasn't I doing that? Well, you know. Sort it's, of. It's, yeah, it's sort yeah. of. You just want to piece your... Because I remember when the last time I did the onions, I lost two fingers and I was a bit not reluctant to yeah. do that. So I understand where you're at, but this is going to get you there just that a little, little bit, little bit quicker. quicker. Piecing it all up together. So, hey, you're good at this. Well, not as good as some, but you know, and then when you've got your. I've seen them on my kitchen rules or something, do it like that. Yeah. They, well, probably more so Master Chef. Oh, Master Chef. Yeah, that's what's on there. I now. knew I was in the area. Yeah. <laughs> we were my, uh, oh. my kitchen rules. Oh. You were watching with the grandkids and all that sort of stuff. So, you've done. I mean, that's, that's good now. So, that's excellent. How's your beer? All good? good. Oh, good. so now I've got. Now it's show and tell time because we got a nice delivery today. I mean, actually, is Rosa up? Ah, there we go. <laughs> How bizarre is this? I've just seen the message. Hi, guys. Sorry I'm late in, which is Rosa. Just in time for. That's what I got. This is from Rosa. Got a nice card and got Hi, some Rosa. tomato seeds. Rosa the Wog, she calls herself. Yeah. Her dad's a Wog, obviously. Um, so we're going to grow some massive um, tomatoes next season. So thank you, my darling. And the homemade card made by Rosa. Like, seriously, guys. We have some very talented uh, fans, I can tell you. So that was nice. Um, also, Smiley, our Smiley Gidget, she... I'll oh, just quickly wave back there. Um, 
she cooked one of Who? our recipes. Smiley is Smiley. her name, and her right. tag is Smiley yep. Gidget. So she cooked one of our quiches during the week. So she's in the running for the Coles voucher. Um, so you guys need to, well, our fans need to get cooking and uh, posting some of our pictures and uh, pictures some of our um, Danelle's just joined us. Mix heading off. Got to keep getting seed into the ground. Sorry, Bob. Say goodbye to Sorry, Nick, mate. everyone. Yeah. We couldn't Wish get you were here, Sorry, Nick, you know. Thank you for trying, though, Bob. Yeah. I'll talk to you later. It was worth a try. But, you know, you're here in spirit, which is nice. Giving me a kiss. I'm not kissing him. He's kissing me. He's like, ooh, ooh. He's a bit like that. Um, so, good photo, too, I've got to say. I'm loving that. Uh, what else we got? Danelle's just joined. Well, I've got another hairdresser now, Danelle, because shaved it all yes. on my own today and then got Kazza to finish it off for me. And I'm still waiting on the ch 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 No, that's not Mick. You've only just joined in. Of course you don't know. Yes, it is. I'm just taller, <laughs> fatter, handsomer, and a lot older. <laughs> yeah. um, this is my mate Daggy Rose. He's um, who I march with on Anzac Day. Him and his wife have come to help me out because Mick's not here. And more locals joining from everywhere. It's a, this is a great night. Um, so it's starting to get there. Here it's starting to squeak a little. Yes. Is yes. that your good ear or your bad ear? Uh, none of them are really good this age, but anyway. <laughs> So it's getting there, and then we're going to seriously be eight minutes. So where do I tip this? Right, as in, not yet. No, 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 that's when it comes out. So when that comes out, we're going to loosen off the um, the pressure so that we can take the lid off without it taking out, off, out the ceiling. And then we're going to add parmesan cheese. Parmesan cheese. Parmesan cheese. Why well, don't like parmesan cheese? Too bad, mate, you're not eating them. Okay. <laughs> Good reason. Yeah. Hello, Michelle. Hi, Michelle. Yep, Michelle's our scoop and way lovely lady. Mickey's still watching. Kylie Dunson's just joined in. Um, Bernie Teasdale. Who? Bernie. Oh, Bernie. Bernie, Bernie. You know Bernie yeah. Teasdale. I haven't seen him for years, but... Yeah, well, yeah, because we none of us can go to the workers anymore. <laughs> um, but Wayne Cody is saying go, Dazza. Shimmer. Ah, shimmer. Right. Coffee. Hard to type while bouncing in a tractor, Mick saying. Um, do, do, no, do, do is sure. It's Johnny hard glasses. to know. Busy. No, it's about um, getting a, your, your head around people's tags, their names and stuff. So, yeah, keeping up with, not really sure. Oh, Carolina. Oh, oh, that'll be Carolina that was on the show. Good to see you. Um, busy as always, another two new stands next week. We're hopefully going to have a lot of support from these guys. Yep. From Scoop and Way. You know when you go yeah. to Coles? Yeah. Have you seen the Scoop and Way stands? I've got to tell you, I haven't been to Coles for a while. Well, you would have seen the Scoop and Way scans. I have seen, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you go in there and you just scoop whatever you want out of all their many, many oh, yeah, varieties yeah. of things. And then you weigh it and then you go out through the checkout and you can buy starting to go. So. Our Michelle Ryan is um, the scoop of our scoop of my lady, and we're hopefully going to do a bit of a partnership with those guys with Champagne Food on a Beer Budget, our TV show. Hey, 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 if we get the budget up high enough, we can just drink champagne. Yeah, no, we've got to have budget. We've got a beer too. You know what I mean? You've got to keep it everyone happy. Yeah, yeah. So, okay. are you hearing this? Yeah, that's good. And it will, it'll get into a motion in a moment. Yep. In a, here it goes. It's getting there. But I'm, now's the time that I turn it down. And the other thing that I do is I set an eight minute timer. Right up. Timer, eight minutes, eight minutes. I can give you an eight minute timer. Just if I have two cans, eight minutes. <laughs> you're all terrible. No, you're not. You're Sorry. very funny. You're funny. I just mean eight, eight minutes. minutes. Can everyone hear it? Let me know. Eight minutes, and then about two minutes downtime. Parmesan, parsley, and then we're in. Uh, what else we got? Yeah, I was a tiny bit late. I was making hoisin chicken and vegetable bake for my family. 
That's very good, Jess. I like that. That sounds amazing. Hoisin chicken. Um, hello, Claire B. Oh, Mick's getting in the groove now, which is good. Ned is here as well. And so, who, tell me, who's, who's your Wayne? Who's Wayne? Shimmer. Tell us. Shimmer. Who's Shimmer? Shimmer, our pool man. Your Is pool man? You don't have a pool. No, but we have very close contact with it. We're getting one. Yeah, we, we're yeah, going to get one. <laughs> he can't, but he can't. He does have trouble because the Murray's so long. Right. He can't clean it. <laughs> well, that is your that's pool, isn't it? Pool. That is your but pool. But it happens difficulty, and I don't, think, it's just your I don't think the EPA licence for chlorine form or whatever it is. What is it? Chlorine. Chlorine. In the Murray. Chloroform. He was so bed. in the war, yeah, wasn't he? Oh, my goodness me. Um, so many messages, and it's hard. Well, I haven't got the glasses on. That's not helping, is it, guys? Seriously. Thanks. Um, oh, I love this. Oh, thanks, Scott. She's saying I love this idea. Now, you Cassie, like, can you, you like me? You're still here with us. I love it. Oh, please, can everyone tell me? Are we? Can we hear the? Ch -ch -ch -ch? Rose is saying hello, Daggy. Rose, Rose, that's Rose in the wall. Yes. That's saying that. See, we yeah. all become one big family. Brett Hall, hey y'all. Hello, Brady. From America. Go, Brady. Brady. Ah, we were talking to you the other night. Uh, actually, Monday morning. No, that's Sunday morning. Is that, that who you're talking hours? about? From America. Do you know, at 2 o'clock. Where do you That's you know, amazing. Fixing your feet. Yeah, you know, 2 o'clock in the morning here. Oh it's my 12 o'clock over there. What are we making, Daz and Kaz, is what he's asking. Daz, you do it. You're good with that. Uh, result. Mushroom risotto. Mushroom risotto, I knew. Eight minute mushroom yeah. risotto, if you don't mind, Bretto. Um, yeah. So, what have we got left? We're only, see, look how time flies. We've got no. five minutes left. Yep. Five, yeah. Only five minutes. Of the, yeah, of the cook time. Oh. Of the... Have we gone okay with, um, I bet you everything looks better when Mick's here because I don't know how to do the lighting when Mick's not here, but... And I don't know how to cook, so it's probably better when Mick's here. <laughs> well, Oh, I know, you're going to eat it. This is what you're yeah, going to eat. Yeah, yeah, I can eat, but I can't cook. Yeah. You can cook, can't you? Toast. Good as toast. And so, and when, okay, let me ask you this. What? When you were on the, what do you call, do you call it, on the road, when you're um, in the Vietnam War? No, no, I wasn't on the road in the Vietnam War. So you're on foot? On foot. Do you have food in your backpack? or I do. And what, are you, what, are, what were you eating? Oh, delicious stuff. Uh, bloody. American rations, which was rice and sausages in brine and... Sausages like, in brine. Yeah, pecan pie. You wouldn't have been eating pecan pie. You were not, were you? Yeah. Tin. Pecan pie and tin. Really? Yeah. Wow. Lovely. There you go. Because I know you so well, I thought you were taking the piss. No. But that's serious. We didn't like Australian rations are not much good. Probably a lot better now. But... Wow. So American rations were actually better than... Much better. Wow, there you go. Sugar, carnation milk, porridge, not porridge, uh, wheat bits. Wheat. No, stick them in, in water for a day and a half and you've got sort of like a porridge. Porridge, yeah, I've got you. Wow. Yeah. That's what Mick's um, been planting, not this week, because he's planting barley to make beer. Chinese are not with us. Don't plant barley. No, well, no, because beer. We need beer. Oh, beer. Dang. Oh, now you're talking my language. Exactly. Right. So. What about a grapevine? For the last week, last week he was planting um, wheat, the wheat fix for Australia. <laughs> he was driving along saying, I'm making wheat fix for Australia. I know how many acres he's got. He hasn't got enough wheat for a week. Not week. here. He's miles away. Oh, he's doing right. hectares. He's doing 8,000 yep. hectares. I'm a thinker. Yeah, I know. I know. Exactly. Um, so, well, that's interesting to know about your food. While you were, anyone got any questions on the Vietnam War? Anyone would like to say thank you, Daggy, for you know? Just asked if we went cooked with one. Well, you're still here, aren't you? <laughs> At the end of the day. Oh uh, yeah. So, um, oh my goodness, there's so much stuff. Hopefully, you guys are all talking to yourself because I've been very. Hello, Christy. <gasps> Hello, Cal. Are you worrying? Are you guys worried because Mick's not here? Well, he is. You can see him there. I'm Mick. <laughs> That's my daggy that I march with on Anzac Day and his wife is here as well. 
So, um, Kerry Williams is watching too. Thank you. I think Mick might be talking about his Mick saying Mick's messaging on Facebook, so he must be talking about the size of his truck. I would assume something about eight hundred. So, what's our time check, Dags? About two minutes to go. Um, so oh, remember yeah. the other week, guys, um, we had uh, Kelly Crawford, or AKA Crawford is her handle, drop in, who is from High Five, and she will be, are you going live tonight, hun? I think that you would be, or is it Thursday? They do a great live from about 9.30. It's fun, it's hilarious, it's musical. Um, her and her boyfriend, Reese are amazing. So, um, we, we we are lucky in this situation, Joe. We do have some kitchen help what outside of this, and she's just going to get me a can. Because, another one? Yeah. Uh, can they see out the back window? They probably can't because she's ducking around yeah. outside the back window. So I'll get. I'll tell you something that's interesting, Dave. In the in the industry, Kelly would know this. They're called runners. Runners. In TV, they're called runners. Oh, I have to they say, run get stuff. Much as I love my wife, she has never run in her life. <laughs> she does both. And she's going to have to come in and do it. Ah, handball, wait, handball, no, no, no. handball. No, no, no. The talent, the talent doesn't go to the runner. Oh, really? <laughs> she's managed to do that without being seen. Well, I'm going to get my pound of flesh here. She's going to do too. Yeah, I'm going to make sure. Yeah, this is going to be good. Look at her go. Yeah. Oh. And runners normally dress in black. And well, we call them ninjas. The difference is, she cannot say what she normally says when I say, Couldn't you get me a can? <laughs> get you yeah. uh, But it's sort of similar. Yeah, that's, yeah, yeah. That's more fun. In a fashion, yeah. In a fashion. In a fashion. Oh. Thanks, Kazza. God love you. You are allowed to speak, though. You can go. And the person told me to be quiet. Right. That's Nina, okay. Who told you to be quiet? The tailor. The tailor. Tailor. whispering. Oh. Yeah, jump, jump on. Can you hear? No one's talking about hearing going or not. I think that's the start of the song too, is it? Can you hear? Not sure. Mm -hmm. uh, I think I can. I think I. <laughs> you can. Smiling. She's a ledge. I think I can. I think I can. I think I can. Change, change, change. Well done, Smiley. You bloody legend. Thanks, Daggy. Leaving beer fridge alone. <laughs> That's for now. That's from Mick, yeah. Tell him I didn't oh, bring a hundred. Everyone's asking. Are you mum's asking if what's dates of birthday? Mum. Oh, Kylie, my mum, yeah. I've met your mum, have I? Mm -hmm. Have you met this man, mum? Are you 40th? Jazz and Kaz. Oh, at my 40th, yeah, so you would have. Yes, we did. a fair time ago. I, my, my age, I can't remember. <laughs> Righto. Ten years to be exact. Ten years. Ten years to be so exact. So I'm going to meet her on the fifth. Yeah. Oh, well, I, my, I had my... Oh, um, oh, let's go. So we're just turning the heat off. Could I ask a question? Yes. I'd Why did we it. have that on that burner? Instead the, of the one at the right of the back. Because that one burns really hot. Really hot. That's my wok burner. Oh, and right. that's not a wok. Okay. So, and what I'm also going to do, though, is I'm going to move it to a different... Burner there. Put the cook on that that's because it's not going. Yeah, that's not hot, so it's going to help the um, temperature drop in that yep. pressure cooker much quicker. So I'm going to leave that for you know a good two or three minutes to actually <sighs> calm down. Like <sighs> Calm down. I'm going to get out the um, the cheese that we need. Oh. Definitely Couldn't slip a cheese. couple of almonds, ginger nut biscuits in there, would you? I no, know. Right. Isn't where I thought it would be. That can't be right. I'm going to have to exit stage over stage, here. Uh, stage one, just exit stage one. <laughs> and go to the freezer. I've left me here all on my own. And oh, here we go. I've got palmers in, guys. Don't oh. panic. Just thought I'd come and say hi. Hey, this is a lot. Ah, uh, yay! Woohoo, yeah. Hello. So she does exist. And I See? don't cook. And she's That's beautiful. That's why I'm not here. These guys are great to us. We have so much fun, don't we? We do. We love you. We love you. Love you. 1 a.m. bloody FaceTime chat since COVID's kicked in. <laughs> Till 2 a.m. and stuff like that. But um, Did you know I was asleep at the time? 
the last time I rang, was he? Yes. Oh. Yes. <laughs> That's all good. Yes. I was hanging on to every word for a first half hour or so after that. What about your friends in America two days ago when you spoke at four o'clock in the morning to them? Oh, wow. I mean, yes, I did come We're in. We're about Hello, to America. Brady. Come back in here. Guys. I don't know where they live. I know they're three hours from Atlanta, but I don't know other than that. Because I've got friends that are in Miami. Oh, are you near Miami? Nick, I don't know. Nick, tell us. Well, they do another live cooking. We actually didn't, didn't ask them where they live, did we? How do you bloody know them? We asked them. Well, Nick and Brett lived here for a long time. Nick had auto barn here. Oh, oh, righto. So we spoke to them. I know they're three hours from Atlanta City, but that's city, but that's all we know. Didn't ask them where they live. We asked about everything. Three hours from Atlantic City. City. And it's such a big place, yeah. isn't it? And we've got um, <clears throat> we've got a lot of followers, followers from Canada that haven't actually checked in tonight either, but it's 6.30 in the morning over there. How rude. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> They're just, great. Alan you just Susan. can't please everyone, can you? They're from Niagara Falls. So, um, yeah, let's see if they've actually replied, though. What was he on, Insta, or? I'd probably better get going, because I think they're going Mon's to just joined. Hey, Mon. Hey. Oh my god, South Carolina, East Coast. Woohoo! There you go, he's still watching. That's Brett. Oh, right, eh? Yeah. South South Hello. Carolina. Hello, Shimmer. And we didn't hang up, Did Brett. It? We Did didn't hang up, Brett, with just the internet or something. We didn't pay our bill. Oh, is that what it was? Yeah. Hey, I wish I should have used that stuff. That's. Oh, yeah, you'll be able to do Darryl. that. No, no, that's not to cut. Oh. That's actually a scoop. They're in. waiting for the golf swing. Oh, gosh. Golf swing. I hope JD's watching. All right, just up. There you go, girls. You got it. What was that, Dad? Yeah, I missed that. No, no, that one. What? They're sports stars. I wanted a good golf swing. South Carolina. Oh, Check in there, Brett. Awesome. Are you known for your golf swing, Dad? I've been known to swing. No, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, I'm not really known for my golf swing. Hi, Kobe and Denzel and Marley. Hi, and Denzel. Miles. Oh, really? Is the family right. joining? Be, yes. Oh, yeah. that's so cute. Beautiful. Well, I've got some friends that I'm going to take to the cleaners when I get to oh, the yeah, screen developed. Oh, yeah, we're going to Beautiful. It's 6.40, see? 6.40 in the morning. Over there. See, that's that's dedication. That and they get dedication. out of bed just to listen to this. And that's what I was saying about my guys in Miami um, and, and our guys in... Um, Canada, Niagara Falls, Alan Susie, they do the same thing. And I've got another, we've got other followers that have ordered um, our stubby holder. Oh, right, eh? Yeah, they've actually ordered three of our stubby holders that I've got to um, ship over to Canada. Well, you see, the so, only reason you entice me onto the show is because I get a free stubby holder. <laughs> Damn you, Dad. Do I have to claim it on my tax? <laughs> no. No. Oh. Something's going on about a guitar. There's lots of laughy faces going on over there on Facebook. So do we go to an ad break? No ad breaks. You're well. chilling. Oh, you, if you need to, if you need oh, to, no, do, just, you, you, know, can, I just said, you can. Ed, ed, I said the, the three minute, eight minute, one. Eight, eight minute timer. Yeah, yeah, you can. Yeah, it's you can go that way to the to the inside one, or you can go that way oh, to the. Oh, it's much more fun the, out by the fire. <laughs> back in to the, the outside one. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Stage one. <laughs> oh, we've got about a toilet break for you in your seventies. Full of love. the love of it. What a classic. All right, so I've still got a little bit of yes going on there, so I'm not quite game to take the lid off that yet. I don't need an accident happening with you guys here. So I'm going to do that instead. And uh, yeah, because I've only got 17 minutes left on the clock. So I'm saying I've, I've got a little bit excited with the old day here. And uh, time's gotten a little bit away from it. So I'm just going to. Well, Dad's and Kaz, I've got to say. There we go. Let that do its thing. Um, and then we won't be far off. So, and what I will do is get a bowl. So that we can do our usual plate up, um, make it look pretty and stuff. I will wait for Danny to come back though um, before we go mixing it in. And actually, I might do the mixing it in part here, guys, so that you can 
really see how this all pans out. Because um, as much as it's been heaps of fun, just walk through Dags. It's okay. Sage uh, exit start. No, <laughs> sage left or something. <laughs> That's us. Um, so that we can actually finally get to show you guys because you didn't get to really see anything because it was all on stove top. Um, I'm going to leave that because that's going to be your bit of fun for the night. I'm going to pop it. So, is it, so is it tougher to cut because it's got a bigger board or? No, no, I'm going to put the, um, the fresh cooker on that. I'm oh, going to open right, everything yep. up so these, we yep. usually cook here. So we've got a little um, induction cooker and we actually cook here oh. so that everyone can see. I could have bought mine from home. What's going on. Um, well, the other thing that I could have done, I didn't even think, was the gas cooker that we did last week with the wok burner on it. But with Mick not here, I'm, yeah, I'm a little bit lost without Mick, I've got to say, Dags. What? I'm not... He's not doing it for you? I'm older, wiser, fatter, taller. I know. I mean, you, you are my Anzac buddy, um, but Mick just does stuff. You know what, what? I mean? <laughs> like, he just does I've stuff. been chopping my heart out. Yeah, there's that as well, but then Mick just organises things oh, right. that I don't even think about. I'm not you know a good what I mean? He goes, How about we do this? And I go, Oh, okay. Yep. I'm not a good organiser. You're a great organiser. Is Mick still here? Yeah, he is. Yeah. Bian oh, yeah. Bianca and Alicia, who are we have good cousins, will yeah. know that everything I have is something prepared earlier, and uh, or I'm not good at organising stuff. Right. <laughs> That's what you prepared earlier. You've yep. done very well. And I want you to use that in that. a second. Yeah. It's a, I, I, it's a Rachel Ray thing. Okay. A what? Rachel Ray. Oh, oh she's an American cook. Okay. All right. Guys, pressure cooker. So don't panic. It's not going to go explode or anything like this. It's an old one. It's from an op shop. My mate gave it to me. I didn't even have to buy it. This is Belinda's <laughs> other after all. Mm. Gave it to me. Bit of steam. What? <laughs> Just hit a knock shop. Sorry. <laughs> knock shop. An op OP <laughs> shop, not a K N O C K yeah. shop. Sorry. I'm on. My hearing's not as good as it used to be, but I've got one now. Oh my goodness me. Hey, that right. good. Well, the mushies are just sitting on top at the moment, but mm. what are you got to do? Because it's not going to stir itself in. I don't think so. So what we're going to do is we're going to give it a bit of a stir around. Ooh, look at that. Can you hear it? Yep. Creamy? It's saying... Get me out of it. It's, oh. it, what it's saying is, give me some Parmesan cheese. Oh, right, right. So I've got Parmesan cheese here. That's all good. Don't you love that sound, though? I don't even know it's what you can good. relate it to. Yep. It smells fabulous. So... Throw in your parsley. I'd probably go with about half of your parsley. Uh, Chuck half. some in, Dags. So, what, just one there? Please. Is it better? Yeah. Yeah. Ten, oh, that's ten, ten grams either way. Yep. Leaves or something. And then I'm going to throw in a couple of handfuls of um, parmesan as well. It's about 200 grams, guys, but as you know, I'll pop the recipe up tomorrow or the next day, depending on Tracy. I like to say, Laurie, and that's about, exactly about 200 grams. I, I'm feeling what you're feeling. Yeah. I, I think you're probably you like right. That. Yep. So we're going to go like that. And this is, it just takes on a completely different level then. Beautiful. Oh, see? And then you start to see the stringy bits, guys. Oh, yeah. All right. You start to get the stringy bits. Hang on, I can't get too close because the glass is fog up. <laughs> yep. Alright, I'm gonna bang in a little lid. Now I'm gonna put the rest on top. We're gonna do a little plateful here. And as as our guest, you're gonna be the first person to taste. Because it's usually me. And I generally like everything that I cook. So can you see guys? Looking good. But it's uh it's glossy. And the other thing that you could do is bang in um, some butter if you really wanted to be a bit naughty. Because then it'll give it a real gloss. But at the end of the day, you've got to go in for the... Go like that. Beautiful. And then we're going to go like that. We've got to give the... I've always got to go up to the camera and give the... The food porn shot. 
Incoming, incoming. Food porn. Smells really good. <sighs> yes. Food porn, righto. Get ready for Daggy. And don't burn yourself though, because it's freaking hot, obviously. Okay. Because it's just come out of a pressure washer. A pressure washer. <laughs> And this is our dinner that we're going to have around the campfire. Well, the fire pit, anyway. Time check. Oh, we've got 11 minutes. <laughs> oh. Just joking. It's not too hot. It's really nice. Like it? Yeah, yeah. I've got my fork. Make it my way, Chef. Got to make sure it is. Oh, I didn't put any seasoning on it at all, which it needs, generally. Seasoning? The salt and pepper. Oh, right. Uh, this salt will be off. It tastes like as it is. It tastes great. Mm. Yep. Well done. Oh, no, no. <laughs> hey, oh, yeah. <laughs> We're not yeah, doing not that, that yeah. sort of stuff anymore. Oh, my God. How hard is that? That's, That's nice. good, Dags. Like that. Pepper I do like, though. For you, I'll go some salt. And for me, I'll go some pepper. How do you feel about that? Yeah, yeah. So I can have another piece? Yeah, go if you like. Do you want to come in, Kaz? No. <laughs> so, did you want any spices at all? Well, I've never seen anything like that. Yeah. So I believe in your next house you're going to be having one of those. Yeah, you guys can't see that, but that's our spice drawer. I think we might have shown you before. It's, it's on our Instagram page or Facebook page anyway. There's about a thousand dollars worth of spice there. Yeah, I think there's something like uh, fifty. Four different herbs and spices. It's, um, yeah, it's the Barlow spice drawer. So, um, anyway, that's us done. So I'll quickly, we've Thank got you. nine minutes left. Nine to minutes? See, nine, well, before we actually get shut off. Should we sing? Or so, or... <laughs> you can. Uh, Phil Radley. Hey. Oh, I didn't know that you are on Insta, Phil. So that's awesome. Mash did. Um, and we are going great. Catch up with who's here, Janine. Awesome. Where's Mum? I've gone to Rachel Ray. Oh yes, my Mum's got one of those Rachel Ray. I actually bought it for her. What's the, what's, so what's what? Well, I call that my Rachel Ray. What's that? That. That's a Rachel Ray. I call, well, it's a Rachel Ray um, appliance. Oh, I bet your engineers use that as measuring tools because it's got everything on. I know. It's incredible. It's really cool. All right, well, I reckon we wind up, Dags. What right. do you reckon? Well, I'd just like to say, Louie, better than mashed potato. And Shimmer, I'll bring you some home. There you go. And uh, everyone say goodnight to Mick. We miss you. Bye-bye. And... Bye. Got... <laughs> what are you Thanks just... for coming. Jump in here, Kaza. Quickly. That's the way. So, not good so, night. So hey, that I... we know that she's here. I got it. I got it. Yeah, right. Yeah. Oh. oh. <laughs> no. <laughs> You're not supposed to be hanging off me. Oh. <laughs> He's married to me. Well, yeah, you're hanging off me, husband. <laughs> Holy moly. Um, thanks, guys. I know that it's been a bit of an unusual one, but um, it's been fun. We've had a great time. Don't know if Vic's going to be home for Thursday. Don't actually know if we're going to be home for Thursday because I've got to head down to Melbourne for some, a couple of exciting meetings. Thanks. So, But having said that, uh, if we're down in Melbourne, we might be able to do it from where we are or just join in or... Whatever the case may be. But um, cheers, you guys. Cheers, cheers. Thanks for everything that you've done. Cheers, looking up your kilt. Beautiful. And um, we're going to go and enjoy some risotto. The recipe will be available on our webpage, obviously, champagnefoodonabeerbudget.com.au. The video will be available uh, tomorrow or the day after, Champagne Food on a Beer Budget on uh, YouTube. And don't forget to sign up for those things because whenever we load something up, you'll get a notification and um, you can enjoy our stupidity. I've been mean, sharing it all my life. Most people <laughs> tell you, right? I mean, another, just another day in my life. It's been heaps of fun though. So, um, all right, do guys. We, do we, oh, do we, oh, what? Right, before we go. Yeah. Oh, you're going to say goodnight to you, mate. This no, is, no. this is Daddy's. This is the bloke that taught me everything. <laughs> and uh, I've got a lot of... Thank you, thanking for. He's good, isn't he?
I love him. I, you don't even want to know where he came from. There's a very, very funny story about that. Hasn't got coronavirus or anything. I just nope. give him a kiss. Mick acquired him for me. So, all right, guys, you take care. We'll see you on Thursday, 8 o'clock, COVID cooking class. Um, thanks for joining in. And um, just a shame we couldn't get Mick. Heath has just joined in. Her, Heath Verhey, one of our favourite people. Um, so we'll see you on Thursday. Don't know with Mick or without, but um, thanks for sticking with us. You guys are ace. Night-night. Cheers.